Hello everyone and welcome back to a, another video. Today I'm bringing you guys episode 4 of building Umbara in Lego. So unlike last week where I made little to no progress on the actual build itself, this week I've got quite a lot of progress done. I got some tiles in from Bricklink recently so I was able to get some de a decent amount of work done. I actually have a little bit of a time lapse from a live stream I did a couple days ago where I basically just kind of started building up the tiles and the terrain a little bit before I then finished it off stream. Sadly there isn't a ton of time lapse footage since my camera did run out of battery but I thought I'd show you guys the little that I got. So enjoy the time lapse and then I'll go ahead and show you guys everything else that I got done. So here's a look at everything that I got done. As you can see, I pretty much tiled all the way over here. None of this was really done in the last episode. Give you guys a little bit of a better look to you, just so you guys can see what I've been doing. Basically been making these little mounds. I've been using these tan plates and then placing these tiles on top, just kind of layering them back and forth and putting some cheese slopes in there every now and then just to kind of slope some of the edges off a little bit, some of those tiles get a little bit sharp sometimes so adding those cheese slopes in definitely kind of makes it look a little bit more natural for sure and then over here we've got these little grass things as i said earlier just using some jumper plates and and studs there as well to to place those where i want to and using those jumper plates kind of offset some which makes them look a whole lot more natural instead of just being in the same spot every time i would have continued this down here but i am actually out of black cheese slope something i didn't expect to, to run out of so quickly so i'm gonna have to get some more of those did a little bit of work down here as well left this little gap here once again because i'm out of cheese slopes but i did continue it a little bit over here and onto this other light that i added in which i have hooked up to the battery got that little a little bit of a mound there just to kind of make the terrain a little bit different. And here in the middle, I actually did drop this down a plate just to kind of once again make the elevation unique, not just have the bottom level this this uh, one brick high every single time. So overall, super duper happy with how this is looking. Next episode, I kind of hopefully will be able to uh, continue what I've been doing over here and hopefully double the size of this and extend it to hopefully finish all of this, this base plate next time. That'll be nice to get done. But that is going to about wrap up today's video. So if you did go on to enjoy it, I'd really appreciate it if you could subscribe and leave a like. But other than that, I'll see you all in the next video. Bye. Bye.